Hello Clean Freaks and welcome to Clean Freak and Germaphobe. Today we're going to talk about the best stainless steel cleaner for your stainless steel appliances. What looks better than shiny, clean stainless steel appliances in your kitchen? Sleek, modern, and new look that looks great with a wide variety of decor. And it's resistant to stains and making stainless steel a popular choice for decades. But the drawback is, is that stainless steel is also a magnet for fingerprints, smudges, water spots, and on their shiny surfaces. And if you have kids, you're going to see every little fingerprint. So today's video is going to be all about how to clean your stainless steel appliances and the best stainless steel cleaner. The problem is you can get used to your stainless steel appliances looking just okay or even looking not so great, but there's a way that you can keep them looking like new. So I find myself wiping the fridge handles several times a day and I do the oven as needed, but usually once a day. And then I do a thorough weekly clean where I'll clean and shine all the stainless steel in my kitchen. I don't know if you know this, but stainless steel is different and all of them respond differently to different cleaners. And so when you ask someone what works best, you get a lot of different answers. But today I'm going to share the way that I found that works best on a variety of stainless steel. First, what doesn't work. Avoid using harsh abrasives. It can leave dark spots on your stainless steel. And don't use scouring powder, steel wool, bleach, and ammonia because they can all damage the surface. And over time, even tap water can damage stainless steel and make it begin to rust. So we don't recommend that either. Next, what we've tried so far. WD-40 work, but I won't use it. Why? Well, turn over the can and read the warnings on the back. You really don't want W4 residue on your hands or around food. The warnings recommend not having the can near electricity because it can burn a hole in the can and cause the contents to burst into flames. <laughs> or direct inhalation of vapor or mist may be harmful or fatal. What? Fatal? Next is olive oil. This is another popular choice and it does work. I have used it. But if you use too much, it can get gummy and can attract more dirt and you have to work it in really well or it leaves a residue. Now, no matter what you use, make sure that you wipe with the grain. Before you start, look at your appliance and identify the grain of steel on it. You'll find that if you look closely at the surface, you'll get the most shine if you wipe in the direction of the grain instead of against it. While you won't ruin anything by wiping against the grain, it's much less effective. Now let's get to what to clean with. Wyman Stainless Steel Spray is my top pick for stainless steel. It's highly rated and effective, and it's used by professional cleaners. It has a neutral pH formula that quickly cleans, shines, and protects your stainless steel surfaces. And it works on black stainless steel too. To me, best of all, it leaves a protective barrier that prevents against smears, dirt, and smudges. Where can you use it? Well, you can use it on your stainless steel refrigerator, your microwave, oven, stove, including the knobs, your grill, sink, range hood, stainless steel toaster, and even trash cans. We'll put a link in the video description so you can check it out. It's totally affordable and available at most major retailers. Best results, use it along with a microfiber cloth. Now I've talked about these before. I always mention them because they're my favorite after trying so many brands. And actually Norwex was my favorite brand and I still really like it, but the price tag is a little bit steep and I don't always like having to go through an MLM. Mr. Sega is a fraction of the cost. They stay soft and they really fit my budget. Basically you wanna spray directly onto the appliance and then use a microfiber cloth to buff it. See how shiny and streak free it gets? Now, the only thing that this cleaner doesn't do is it can't get the lime stains that are by the water dispenser in our refrigerator. We do use lime away for that part. This is another spot that always seems to be a problem is where you put your cup against the water dispenser and it just gets kind of yucky. Now, a trick that I use to make sure that I get everything is I try to look in the light so the sunlight will show any spots that I missed. It's so reflective that you can even see. Okay, now for the sink. Beautiful that looks, it's almost like a mirror. I did do a video about how to clean your garbage disposal and I think you should check it out because 
underneath its black stopper, all sorts of bacteria and buildup and yucky stuff exists and you've got to get that stuff out. Otherwise your sink can start to stink. I'll put a link to that in the video description. Let's see if I can capture the kind of the streaks that you can see right there. It kind of doesn't look great. And they have some streaks, have some streaks going on down there. So let's get those out. Wow. Just look at that now. And now for the stove. It just kind of shine up and then for these these get kind of corroded and gross i put them in a plastic bag with ammonia overnight and then rinse them and clean them and that stuff comes right off this also has some streaking just when we cleaned it so i want to just shine it up wow That is looking amazing. I love it. The thing about cleaning is I don't love to do it actually, but I love the payoff. Now if we could just figure out how to get rid of those scratches. What do you use to clean your stainless steel? Let me know in the comments. And thank you so much for watching today. Remember, if you like what you saw, please make sure to subscribe and ring the bell so you don't miss our future videos. And don't forget to share and pin this video so that your friends can see it and enjoy it too. We always appreciate it when you guys share our videos. It helps and encourages us to keep making more videos. In our next video, I go over the features of the Dupre Neat Steam Cleaner and how you can clean almost everything in your house with just water. I'll put a link to that video and we'll see you in the next video.